Hi guys, this is Andy from Nismo Tech UK. We're giving an overview for Lindy and this is one of their PCIe expansion cards. This particular card here allows you to connect a USB 3.0 internal header onto the actual card enabling you to power your front USB ports for example. Um, obviously it's a very good expansion card if you are like us and you have got a motherboard that does support USB 3.0 but doesn't have an internal header or for example if you have a a fan controller that um, has two USB 3 ports at the front and goes to an internal header which is already used up by the actual case itself it does mean that you are able to power your USB 3.0 um, on the fan controller as well so it's a really good expansion card it also features a low profile bracket so you are able to interchange the actual brackets which is nice to see and it does come with a two-year product warranty as well so we've got the Lindy logo up at the top with the red and black theme um, Moving on to the back, um, a little bit of information about the various different cards that are available, um, etc. So let's get into this and have a, a closer look at the actual card. Just bear with me. And we also have some literature, etc. at the back here. So let's just cover that first of all. We have got the sort of quick start guide, um, how to actually install the card onto your motherboard and install the actual drivers um, which are available via the CD. We also have a little literature uh, sort of brochure here which demonstrates the, the various different products available on the Lindy website so it's a good idea to, to go and check them out because they've got some fantastic products um, available on the actual website. Onto the actual card itself, um, as you can see it's extremely small. We've also got the USB 3.0 header there. It's powered by the SATA connection right up at the top. Um, not really much more to say about the actual card. Like I said, it is extremely small, so it's not going to interfere um, with any airflow or anything like nature. And I see there's the low profile bracket. So I'm now going to go and install this into one of our cases. Okay, so as you can see guys, I've got the uh, card installed into the actual case here. Quite self-explanatory how you would go about installing that. Grab your uh, USB 3.0 header and basically connect that onto that end there. And then all that you need to do after that is to connect a SATA power connector up to there. And that's basically it. Obviously you are going to have cables trailing across uh, the motherboard area. So if you've got a side window, uh, you may want to sort of consider about how you're going to route them. But at the end of the day, it's going to provide a USB 3.0 uh, connector to the front of your case. If you've not got it on your board, which this particular board doesn't have, this is ideal for you. Or if, like I've already mentioned, you have got a uh, fan controller or more than two USB 3.0 ports at the front, you are able to obviously connect the additional one to this card. So we hope you like the uh, sort of mini unboxing and overview for the actual card itself. Performs very well. Never had any issues uh, with regards to setting it up or using it in, in any way, shape or form. And data transfer rates using the actual card is absolutely fine. There's been no loss of speed at all. Um, so we hope you liked the video and we look forward to seeing you in our next. We hoped you liked our video review. If you did, then please leave a like as well as any comments or questions you may have down below. Full details and specifications on this item can be found at our website, nismotech.com, along with all the links for purchasing if you wish. Also on our site, you'll find our latest reviews and current giveaways, plus a lot more. We look forward to seeing you in our next review.